Okay, so solving compound interest. So this is the formula to solve for the future value. A, that's the future value. P is the principal value. Then R, that's the annual rate. M, that's the number of compounding. And T, that's the number of years. So we have this problem. So if you deposit 40,000 pesos into an account, paying 5% annual interest, then compounded quarterly, so how much money will be in the account after 6 years? So first, we need to identify the given on this problem. So we have this uh, principal, that's the amount you deposit. That's 40,000 pesos. Then the rate, it's 5%. Then convert this one to decimal, it's 0 0.05. Then for the time, that's 6 years. And for this number of compounding, the M, so these are the guides. So for annual, M is 1. For semi-annually, M is 2. For quarterly, that's 4. And for monthly, that's 12. Now, since on this problem, compounded quarterly, therefore, M is 4. Then to solve for the future amount, this is the formula. Substitute the values. So we have this uh, P, that's 40,000 times 1 plus R, that's 0 0.05. And M, that's 4 to the power M times t, t is 6. Then simplify. So we have 0 0.05 divided by 4 equals 10 plus 1. That's 1 1.0125. And this 4 times 6, that's 24. So the future value now. So we have 1.0125 to the power 24 equals then times this 40,000. So the future value is 53,894.04. So we have 53,894.04 pesos.